Buenos Dias friends, it is actually quite early right now where uh, I am in the lobby of the hostel that I am staying at here in Medellin. This is Los Patios, one of the best rated places in the city and I can concur, it is pretty fabulous. Uh, but what we are... Gracias, perfecto. <laughs> Muchas gracias. Yeah. Well, look at that, guys. I got my beautiful Colombian breakfast here. Uh, very excited. Uh, but what I have booked for today is a tour of one of the most popular day trips outside of Medellin, which is Guatapé. Guatapé is basically a resort town where they have a man-made reservoir of these like beautiful lakes. It is just like a stunning place. And there's also this huge rock which is like the main attraction of the city that you can you know climb up and down get a great view of the city you can of course go for longer than one day but i just figured with the ease of you know having a bus take me there and then take me back and show me all the main attractions in one day i just thought that that would be the easiest way to go All right, friends, we are at our first stop of the day, which I guess is a replica town of a place that used to be called El Peñol. And it's a super cute, very colorful uh, little districts. There's lots of little souvenir shops, lots of cute cafes, and you have this beautiful uh, view of the start of the valley and as I said before uh, the lake reservoir that you'll see is actually man-made they did make it as a you know hydroelectric uh, generator but it really is a unique place I've never seen a uh, kind of elevation changes like this with the lake flowing in and out through so many areas Well, <laughs> this is unlike anything I have ever seen before, my friends. Uh, this huge rock is called La Piedra, and uh, they're saying that it only takes 15 minutes to get to the top with that massive staircase, but uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> One quick thing I want to mention, uh, because I almost had a heart attack, uh, our guide said, okay, you know, when you buy your tickets, you have to show your passport and your vaccine certificate. And I was like, what? <laughs> Nobody told me I had to bring my passport. But thankfully they do take photocopies or just showing it on your phone, which I do have, so thank God. But just wanted to make a mention that, yeah, if you're thinking of coming here and want to climb it, you need those two things.
Well, <laughs> this is definitely one of the most unique views I have ever seen. It is absolutely stunning. I guess this rock has actually been here for about 65 million years and uh, geologists believe that it was formed when tectonic plates clashed against each other. There was a whole bunch of rock that came up to the surface, but this one was obviously the biggest. It is 657 steps to get to the very top here. You definitely do feel the elevation, but at the same time they really have uh, modernized things where they have like a little cafe, you can get some ice cream, have a beer, just relax. Sadly you are not allowed to fly drones up here which would be so cool because the view is absolutely stunning but uh, not to worry. I did find some shots of this area on a stock site that I use so enjoy. <laughs> So guys, we are in the town of Guatape. It looks absolutely beautiful. But before we get to explore it, we are actually gonna do a boat ride on the water here. And uh, they did tell us that we can go swimming today. So I did bring my bathing suit, but to be honest, it's a little bit too chilly, I think. Alright friends, we just got to downtown Guatape and it is such a scenic and you know photogenic little town. It's so colorful and apparently there's even like a story behind all of the pictures that you'll see on the different houses like lambs I guess are one of the emblems that are used a lot and uh, my guide was saying that that kind of has to do with Christianity. So we have been given about an hour to walk around the town. We can go to cafes, wander around the streets, there's little shops around here. Overall I was told this is a very safe place for tourists to visit. It definitely 
definitely um, you know would be fine to come here yourself you don't have to go on a tour but it is just nice if you only had a day and want to see everything all at once it is a lot easier with a tour Look how lovely this is, guys. What a view at the top of Guatape. Just gonna have a little coffee break. I am really enjoying my time here and actually a little bit sad that I didn't uh, book a night or two here because I could have totally live streamed here. Like everybody has their phone out. It feels, you know, super safe and a much more relaxed vibe than a lot of places that I've been to. So now that I've walked around and seen how nice it is, I'm a little bit sad that we're gonna be leaving um, after we grab some food, but at least I can now suggest to you guys that it would definitely be worth uh, spending a couple of nights here. All right, friends, this brings us to the end of a fabulous, fabulous day. And as I mentioned before, I would have loved to stay three, four, five days here, just because there is actually a lot of other activities that you can do here. It's super relaxing. And as I mentioned before, it's also a very safe area. But if you are short on time, a day trip is also fantastic. I loved uh, the tour that we did today. And uh, also just to mention, if you did wanna do the particular tour I did. It is through Los Patios Hostel. It's their personal tour, which goes only on Tuesdays and Thursdays. They do offer tours the other days of the week, but they are with another company. And from my understanding, it's like a huge bus of people and you don't get to do as many things. So I would recommend um, doing their personal tour because it was a really great time. But let me know in the comments. Let me know if any of you have been to Guatape, if you have any suggestions, uh, because this is just such a beautiful place to visit. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for tuning in. And as always, keep being your own kind of beautiful. Bye guys.